It was a wild scene on Detroit's west side today. A man jumped off an overpass onto the lodge freeway to escape someone who was shooting at him. Part of the freeway at Seven Mile was shut down during the police investigation. Victor Williams has learned that man is expected to survive. Well, we're told by witnesses that this all stemmed from a car chase between two vehicles that ended up in a crash right here at this Michigan left. In fact, you can still see some of the tire marks here from where that vehicle jumped the curve. But here's where things get even more dramatic. We're told that to avoid catching a bullet, a man jumped off the side of this bridge right onto the freeway. Tonight, a 23-year-old man is in temporary serious condition after jumping onto the launch freeway. 4.30 Sunday afternoon is when police got a call for what was believed to be a suicide in progress. That wasn't the case. Instead, it was a man trying to get away from someone and a black Jeep who was shooting at him. Police are saying just moments before the jump, the victim was in this gray Pontiac Torrance speeding to get away from the black Jeep when it crashed. Skid marks show the place where the impact happened near the southbound side of the freeway. The victim got out the car and seeing that he had no other option, the 23-year-old jumped onto the freeway miraculously, still able to run after the long drop down. No cars hit the man as he ran. No accidents happened as a result either. Medics were able to offer aid after he found himself in a safe position. Police closed down part of the lodge as they investigated, even retrieving a shell casing found on the ground. Thankfully, no one else was hurt. And police are still on the lookout for the people responsible for firing those shots to begin with. So if you know anything, you're advised to contact Crime Stoppers to leave an anonymous tip at 1-800-SPEAK-UP. Reporting on the northwest side of Detroit, Victor Williams, Local 4.